We need people to get into good trouble. All of us really need to be doing something good to make this country better. In this particular Quoted by series, you're about to meet an extraordinary woman who I had the privilege of interviewing 20 plus years ago when I was a, a reporter in New Orleans. Her name is Ruby Bridges, and Ruby was the first African-American to be integrated into New Orleans public schools. And Ruby, I remember the day you walked through the door and I got to meet you and I was looking at you and I was so um, just sort of just inspired by how just how you were. You seemed so like someone who was unfazed by all the history that you had changed. First of all, how are you? I'm good. I'm good. Uh, as a matter of fact, I'm, I have to say that we just went through uh, a hurricane. And so I'm sitting here with no power and some trees down. But, you know, that's typical New Orleans. Well, Ruby, if anyone can withstand a storm, man, it's you. You've, you've withstood <laughs> many different kinds of storms. And I was curious if you had a quote uh, something that, that sort of moved you and that you live your life by. I think about John Lewis and I think about how he, you know, would say that we all have to get in trouble. We have to get into good trouble. And um, I, I kind of, I think, lived my life by that because of that experience at six years old. You know, I, I've always felt like, hold it, if we were going to get past our racial differences, that it was going to come from our young people and that they needed to get involved. And so hearing him say, go out and get into good trouble, I think that was something that, you know, stuck with me. And, um, you know, something that I tell young people all the time. Get in good trouble. I do love that, Ruby. And I yes. love that um, that you were just sort of this model. And I'm, there's another John Lewis quote that I know that is also one of your favorites. Don't get lost in a sea of despair. Be hopeful, be optimistic. Our struggle is not the struggle of a day, a week, a month, or a year. It is the struggle of a lifetime. Never be afraid to make some noise and get in good trouble, necessary trouble. That's kind of the full context. How does that make you feel hearing those words again? You know, it is so meaningful right now at this moment that we're in. Um, because we need people to get into good trouble. All of us really need to be doing something good to make this country better, especially now. And, you know, my work is with young people, and I think that, you know, what John Lewis, what his life stood for, and just that whole quote, you know, inspires young people. And, um, it's just so timely right now to think that he said that, you know, so long ago and thinking about his own life and, you know, the advice that his parents gave him, you know, and here it is, mm -hmm. you know, so meaningful right now at this particular moment. So, well, Ruby, you are a walking, talking inspiration. I've had the privilege of knowing you for 20 plus years and it has been my privilege. Thank you for everything that you're doing to make the world better every day. You're helping young people. You're helping grown-ups like us. So I want to say thank you, okay? Thank you, Hoda. You are such an inspiration. I mean, you know, to think that you were here and now you're there. And so many young women get a chance to kind of see you and be inspired by you. So it's what we both should be doing.